So what's cool about this casino is that they got windows wide open so you can see what time you need to go home. You can see outside. Yeah. It's really nice. I don't know if I'm going to do another walkthrough. Because, uh... Let's do our favorite spots. Yeah. Like food area. Yeah, let's go follow me as we go to our favorite food spot. Here we go. To the right. Right. To the right. Very well lit in here. And yeah. it doesn't smell like cigarettes. No, it doesn't. Let's go oh, put our... Oh, they have the game that we loved at the uh, other place. Railroad Bitches? Yeah. I think they have every game here. Let's go put our name in. So we are going to go eat over there at Shang. Artisan Noodle. Yeah. Their wonton soup is very good. Their food is good. Every, yeah, their food is good. So we're going to... We're gonna go over there. Follow us as we go put our name on the. Look at all this. Coffee roasters. Shang Artisan. Oh. You can sit here, love. Yeah, because I know you like to look out at stuff, so I will sacrifice looking at the waitresses here. <laughs> okay. Noodle soup. Oh, the wonton noodle soup is bomb. I'm getting that. So yeah, this is how they're making the noodles. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Look at this wonton noodle soup. That pork belly. Oh my goodness. Eh, and a Pepsi, whatever. It's pretty. All right, everybody, we're at Durango, and now I am going to do a thorough walkthrough this time. I did one before, and uh, it wasn't too thorough. I'm actually going to go around the perimeter of the casino, and then I'm going to walk down every aisle and end up going by the food court. All right, here we go. As you can see, the windows are very clear, very bright for you to see what time you need to go home. <laughs> we got the station sports betting over here. Let me show you the sports betting area with the bar in the middle. Check this out. Yeah. Wow. So it's a station's casino, I guess. My rewards. The ceilings are very tall here. Ventilation is pretty good too. It's not that bad. Oh, over here is the George restaurant. Oh. So yeah, walking over here as you can see, there's aisleways that I'm going to be walking down back and forth after I do the uh, perimeter walkthrough. So Durango Casino, I don't think they've been opened up a year yet. It's been, they opened up last uh, December, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. It's Nico's Prime Cuts and Fresh Fish. So there's your bar in the middle. This entrance over here has all the old Game Kings next to the Miho restaurant. So the bar right here on this right hand side is called Oasis. Yeah, 
check out these games. These are very well, yeah, like new monitors on these things. They're really, really well lit. Check out the entrance here. That is Niho restaurant. That is nice. It reminds me of uh, what's that old restaurant? Rainforest Cafe. This whole theme reminds me of that. <clears throat> wow, this place is big. Don't mind me uh, not really talking much because I just ate at the restaurant. I think it's called Shang. It was so good. We will walk over there at the end of this tour. But they have uh, fresh noodle soup over there. They make the noodles fresh. And it was just, uh, I am so full. I got like food coma right now. What is this? Summer House Santa Monica. It's a, it's a bar. Bar and patio. It's a cookie bar. Look at that. Seems like on the outside, um, outside of the uh, perimeter of the casino, they have all the Game Kings, Kinos. Electronic blackjack and poker. I'll try to hold the camera like this so you can see. Oh, look at that screen. It's huge. There's a lot of space to walk around on the outside, but we'll see how it is walking on the inside. <clears throat> Puff and even more puffs. Wow, check it out over here, the hotel registration area. Hotel registration. What is this? It's a coffee. Is this coffee section? Yeah, it's called Vesta Coffee Roasters. Espresso sounds good right now. I need to wake myself up from eating that food, man. Oh. So, there's a gift shop. bar in the middle over there too. We'll cross by that when I do the uh, walk through of the center. High limit slots right here on the left. Let's take a look in here. Let's wander through here real quick. So they got the bar over here too. Dragon Cash. Yeah, Dragon Cash has their own individual grand jackpots. Different from Dragon Link. Well, last time I came around here, they had this set up different. These ones here were like on a straight aisle way. Look at that. Hand pay for him. $13.95. Nice. The ventilation in here is really good. It is quiet in here. Hmm. All right. I'm not even done with the perimeter yet. <laughs> Player services. to turn the camera so you can see the 
casino floor instead of street. Ooh, they got live Baccarat over here. Let me turn over so you can see. Ooh, live Baccarat dealers. Yeah, I'll check this out. It's your live Baccarat dealers. Wow, all your Baccarat players here. Look at that. limit tables in the middle. I'm not walking through there. Alright, let's turn this camera so you can see this the casino floor. Got a lot of Buffalo games in the middle here. Food court, which I will be walking through later. Oh, someone dropped their 65 cents. Food court will end up going over here later, as you can see. I am gonna actually end up over by the front and I'm gonna crisscross and go down every single aisle as much as I can. And <laughs> very detailed walking tour. Alright, so let's start way over here. Alright, here we go. Let's try this out. I think I might go down every other one. Every single one is gonna be too much. I'm gonna go out on every other one so you can see. Alien Attack Kino. Look at that, I've never seen that. So you can tell right here, this is going to be hard for people with wheelchairs to come through. Yeah. She was right when she said that there's lots of dragon links here. Yeah, look at this. It's pretty, pretty packed in here. Sportsbook area again. Planet Lula. You want to see something funny? Just so you know, look what you can do with this watch. We got 65 cents here, right? And I'm going to the Dragon Link right here. I'm going to do a dollar. Lucky chance. See if I get it. And I got it. Let's see if I win anything. Last time I did this with like 17 cents, I won like $30. Yep. Nope. 
Uh, that's how I play extra tickets, leftover tickets. Just toss them in there. Well, sometimes you win, most of the times you don't. But one time I put in 17 cents, I did 50 cents, and then I got like six, six orbs. Ended up getting much more. Won 30, $34. I think I put a video of that up. Every single aisle, it would be take way too long, but you guys could probably see all of the slot machines that are around. All right, let's cut through here, go down a couple aisles, and then go back the other way. See, I think I got Dragon Links all over the place Dragon Links and Buffalo Games. I still have food coma. I'm like tired. I'm dragging my feet right now. At least I'm walking slow. Hopefully it's a, a good quality video of me walking. The last time I did the Durango walkthrough, I don't think I walked through up and down like this on the aisles. I just went through the middle. Yeah. So look at the opening right here. It'd be very hard for people to go through. the Oasis bar which I went on the other side and go over to this section and then uh, I think that's where the bubble craft games were. Ooh, these guys are playing the roll to win made by a ruse. Craps. A lot easier for the chips. I see crapless over there. Yep. Okay, here we go. Carousels of dragon links all over the corners of this casino. There's your interblock roulette. And I see her playing dragon link down there. <laughs> oh, minimum's a dollar here for bubble craps. Cool. Just so you know, last time we were here in January, she played the Lucky Shooter on the Bubble Crabs and had $3 on it and hit it all. It hit in 1,000 to 1, 
and then we gave it all back. <laughs> it happens. It happens. Are you winning? Are you winning? No. I'm not even like a third done of this place. <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright, now we got a zigzag on the other side. Here we go. <laughs> Alright everybody, my battery ran out so I don't know how long or how much video footage I got but here's the uh, eating area Yumori Mi Sushi Shang restaurant over there is the one I highly recommend coffee roasters that's the the Chang artisan noodle they actually make their own noodles over there and it is good I highly recommend the pork belly noodle soup looks like they got Hawaii street food over here pasta Pasta area, and then they got seafood, oyster. I think it's an oyster bar. Sandwich bar in the middle. But yeah, they got an oyster bar here too for all you uh, seafood lovers. Uncle Polly's. Oh, look at this. They got ice cream. Oh my god, the waffles smell so good. Look at this. Ice cream smells so good. Then you got your pizza. And at the end of the pizza is your bar. Well, I don't know how much I recorded because my battery ran out, but uh, hopefully you guys got to see most of it. I walked around the perimeter and that is the Durango tour. Thank you for tuning in. And there you go, Irv's Burgers. Thank you for tuning in. We appreciate it. Um, I'm gonna walk through the middle of the area that uh, I think I missed. If you guys want to stay tuned and watch the rest of this, I don't know how much I I missed of this uh, tour since the battery right now, but here, let's go walk through here real quick. When I say real quick, it's gonna be real quick. <laughs> 